Professor Bright here. Welcome back to Omen Sight, where I made a bit of a mistake. Accidentally didn't record an episode where we went through Draga's timeline. I mean, on the bright side, there really wasn't much gained from going through Draga's timeline. Not much knowledge there. Though we did get some interesting tidbits, so I think in the interest of showing you guys so we all know what I know, if you get my meaning, we're going to go back in time one more time. Because there are some things I feel like we can pick out some more meaning. I'm fair, well, there fairly certain that's way the way we want to do it. Find it. Yeah, there's some moments here that I'm wondering if anyone else picks on something that I'm missing. Because we do get some hints about, well, the war overall. General, I don't know if it ties back to anything before, and I shall capture the core for you. I do not doubt it. But those battalions would turn the battlefield into a graveyard for them. Yeah, that's and fascinating and all. But also, have you heard about this omen site thing? I got a little chorus comes with it. It's very nice. By the way, Radica stabbed Vera. Protect you with my life. Get out, both of you. Do not be surprised. I know who you are. Your presence here. Did you always know who I was, is though? Is it about the priestess? Her death has been I weighing on like my Because I feel like she was more surprised the last time. But it is not just time. that. It is this war. It should have ended long ago. We vastly hmm. outnumber the Rodentians. They are little more than squabbling clans in the best of times. They have little training, makeshift weapons, and, to put it mildly, lack discipline. Yet... I believe some other force is at work. Yet they're handling this entire both the empire thing. And our forces against each other. Huh. Someone wants this war to continue and seeks to weaken us both. Vera stood for harmony. Except Vera she really didn't. Brought peace. So they killed her. But Ratika. That Ooh. I did not expect. General Trager, I depression. wonder then. Riots. Prepare my air barge. Also, they have air barges, by the way. Second thought. Hold that order. This is exactly what you want, isn't it, Radica? We will play your game. But this time, I will be one move ahead. Yes. So, what I was thinking. The Apocalypse Cult is clearly... Um... Uh, trying to prolong this war to weaken both sides to release Vodin. But... Why? Like I mean... Storm. I've said this before, but it is the whole idea of, hey, there's this strong force. Let's worship it, because it's stronger than we are. So, worship it. Also, we found some lore here, which I'll go over in a little bit. But I'm wondering why they needed to weaken both sides. Why was this conflict necessary? And why do they clearly do so much to support the Rodentians? General. Because, I mean, let's be honest, the Empire has stuff like that. Surfers. So, I mean... Good luck, Rodentians, but yeah, you're pretty well screwed if that kind of firepower is against you. Also, I don't think I've seen Rodentian airships, so I'm assuming that's an Empire-only thing. General! Please reconsider. The troops are not ready. And and we still need to fine-tune... Gather the scouts. Then have them scour the woods. Ratika is coming here. Inform me as soon as she is sighted. But, but General... Red flare to mark her position. Questions? Dismissed. Hmm. Yes, sir. I have several questions, actually. Because I don't know that they actually send out a flare at any point, so... Hmm. I suspect we got some traitors in our midst. You want me to go back and kill all those guys? You know, and just in case they're traitors? Indrik will let me kill them all. Of course, Indrik was kind of, well, a bit of an asshole, kinda. I mean, he's Emperor. They're typically assholes, but still. Especially assholish for an Emperor. Yeah, about that. And that's 
that's you dead, and that's you gone, and you out of my way. Nah, <laughs> that's cute and all, but no. Have you considered also no? Okay, I could have done better there, but that's fine. Ooh, side note, I now have this whole... Yeah. Explosive bolt from leveling up the last ep well, between last episode and the episode that never was. So that's neat. Alright, alright, alright. Something is wrong. Is it the fact that this thing needed fine tuning? Because it needed fine tuning? Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. Real quick, since we have like ten seconds. Do you want to just check one? Well, I say check something. Go over the lore I found in that little corner. So, Draga finds the Emperor at the outskirts of the camp, facing off with an insolent Rodentian farmer. The farmer demands, What are you doing on our land, high and mighty Emperor? Indrik answers dryly, Your land is shattered. Figari is here to help you rebuild. As the farmer guffaws and readies a retort, Draga steps in. Honorable Rodentian, I know Pegarian presence can feel invasive on account of its being invaders, but Rodentian tradition demands that during the harvest, you accept new proposals. Am I correct? What do you know about our traditions? Enough to respect them, do you? The farmer shrugs his consent. I suppose I can't argue with that logic. The farmer gestures at Indrik. You want to help build, rebuild? Then help. But I'm keeping an eye on you. He walks away, still muttering. The Garians offering help. That's new. The Emperor nods as the farmer's silhouette shrinks in the distance. Well done, Draga, yet I wonder, how do you know Rodentia's intimate details? I study a lot, Your Highness. Every moment that I am off duty, my nose is in a book. With a thin smile, the Emperor says, Is that so? He examines Draga from head to toe. I was considering whether to court-martial you for enabling General Elia's desertion. He adds. Draga gasps. After a long silence, he declares, Tomorrow you head for the Rodentian capital, new general. You will be leading the negotiations. Wait, so that actually means that the Bagarians were helping rebuild Rodentia, and then this war broke out, right? Because that... Oh, okay, that brings up a lot so of other problems. Perfect place huh. For there was a chance for peace, and I'm assuming Soldiers. the Apocalypse Cult, because I, I don't really have a name for them other than that. Yeah decided to sabotage the peace and start this war to release their god, because, you know, why not? Something to do on a Sunday night. Huh. Then I wonder. Oop, none of that. Hmm. Convenient, that. Hmm. But there's... There's explosives. And treasure chests... Could I have those? Could that be mine? Because I want them. Just. Let us pray the fury will break down Yontrick let me have bridge. treasure chests. Of course, he also, you know, forced me to put the difficulty down because his section was so infuriating. Anyway. Hmm, about that. Hmm. 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 Yeah, clean. What? The machine is already here? Not ready. Wow, sucks for you. Bye. I didn't notice before some guys actually go off the side of the rails. That's pretty boss. Anyway, you're dead. Well, most of the way to it anyway. Good night. No. 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 Stop that. Give me my health. Give me my health. Stop. Stop. Nope. Stop. Get I say you could get up. Give me the health. God, uh, not happy with you right now. Okay, Draga, are you still... We are not done yet. Yeah, of course you are. Why would the Harbinger do what? The Kill a bunch of ciphers? We As I suspected, we have a spy in our midst. 
But who? And why are they playing both sides? To resurrect their god of destruction, apparently. Though, why would this war lead to... Uh, I have questions. I feel like this conflict on this day just... It's gotta be the cult causing all this, right? Like, just the coincidence of, oh yeah, this is the day when Indrik needs to go and do his ritual to Together, yes? keep Claude and tempered? Question mark? On fire? Again, question mark? Basically to keep it keeping Vodin down. There's a better way to phrase that, but that's the way I phrased it, and that's the way it's going to be. Anyway, you need to die for me, and uh, so do your friends. It's really unfortunate for them, but, but, here's the thing. Ah, there's no other option for me. Sorry, dudes. If I had another way, I would go for that, but I don't, so... Hey guys, we're gonna do nothing in a few moments. If she surrenders, please stay your hand. I have much to ask her. We mm. can't flail in the dark any longer. We need answers. You see, you say that. Pretty sure we Gunner can flail in the dark for a little bit longer. Amber guns ready. And yet, what are you talking about, amber guns? Huh? Is that what that giant cannon was? Huh? No! And how is she not dead? Like, good on you, but how? Ooh, actually, hold up. Hold up. Had a thought. Nope, nothing back there. Never mind. It was a bad thought. Can it be the Harbinger? Yes. We've established that I am here. Your sword seems unwilling to harm allies. Ah, good question mark. I don't know how you know that, but sure. Knowing her, she probably could find a way to do it. I feel real bad that I keep having to fight Radica. She's like my favorite character, but always the center of attention. I'm your trophy, Draga. You want me? Fight to the end. If we must. Don't lose sight of her. Damn it. Radica, you're always such a pain in the ass to fight too. No. We are not done yet. It can't be. Okay, I was trying to actually shoot you with my little phantom blast, but I guess that's not happening today. There we go. Okay, need some healing. Okay, that needs to stop right now. Okay, there we go. Now. Hey. Puggeration. Yeah. Here's the thing, she will keep just using those bullets. I think the only way to do it is to dodge it until it gives you that little slow motion thing, which I can't do if she's in that corner, so. Yeah, until it gives you this little thing, she's basically just gonna keep pecking away at me until I'm dead. We are not done yet. Yeah, but she is. Oh, 
Or you could not. A thought occurs. Ooh, no. Do me a favor, finish her off for me, so I don't have to. Yep. Mm-hmm. Radica, always the worst fights. Or at least the worst for me. You're not gonna be a trophy, I just want to talk to you. God damn it. Well, more accurately, Drago wants to talk to you. I don't have any preference. Although it said we gained new information, and I... Well. It said we gained new information when I finished this fight the first time, but... I don't know what it is, because... Well, you'll see. We are not done yet. Oh, there was some... Oh, well. I'd have been thinking. Hey, look. I suddenly need all that health. Okay, anyway, right? Where? Nope. Damn it. Ah. Stay in one place so I can kill you. Okay. I'll take this. Duh. Okay, more health. Good. Actually. Now I'm trying to kill Radica, actually. Incoming fury strike. <sighs> Do me a favor. There we go. It's only a few minutes, but still, it infuriates me. I won't let myself become... don't lose sight of her. Yeah, don't worry, I won't. Although now, for some reason, this happens. Whenever it takes control away from me, I just hate that. Like, I, you don't need to show me this, like, right in front of my face. I can be aware of the explosions happening around me. But, ah, eh, well. It's fine in the grand scheme of things. Ah, no. No. Not making this mistake again. It was too forward last time. And I will not be this time. I will be defensive, as I should be. And then that'll happen. I pressed the button to use Delay of Fate, but it didn't go off. I'm pressing the buttons. It's just not happening. Won't let myself become. Uh. Don't lose. Could you not, though? Here, take a phantom blast right to the face. Yeah, let's see your friends real quick. Okay, that recovery time is atrocious. Was it though? Was it really impossible? Do you like my music? I do, but also, yeah, I just need to kill this guy real quick. are causing me trouble. And TikTok. All right. Didn't mean to press that. But here we are. Uh -uh -uh. All right. 
progress made. Come on, Yontrix Fury. Do your job. Hit this spot exactly. This is the hard way. I'm not taking the risk. There we go. Yeah, she's not doing so great. Bring Radica back to camp. Attend to her wounds. I need her conscious for questioning. If you say so. Is this what? Dying feels like had to happen sometime, I guess. If death is not Aww. to your liking, perhaps you should not have started a war. Before Did you she though? Us, Radica, you have much to Did explain. she though? You think this was my doing? I hate to disappoint, but no. I could write you a song with how this drama unfolded. <laughs> if I were in better sorts. Mm -hmm. If you and your conspirators hadn't murdered Vera, you could have been singing those songs right now. Vera. I mean, yeah, Vera was not, well, maybe she was peaceful at one point, before, and I'm thinking she yes. might have been. I killed her. So you admit Yeah, you killed her body, Vera though. Was my friend. I think she was an empty husk if before you killed her. There had been any other way. I suspect. She would be here now. <laughs> No doubt lecturing us. You could have done literally anything else. You know, Draga, it's all those doubts that make your face wrinkle and age you faster. And since you're wasting my precious last words, I need a favor. You can't be serious. You're right. Two favors is more fair. What was I thinking? <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> now come closer. When you see Ludomir, tell him Vera has been avenged. Maybe it'll bring him some peace. Okay, see that didn't actually click be with me before, that but thing. that's a hint that by his hand. we should have Ludomir or kill Radica. Poetic, I'd say. Still, okay. I'm the lucky one. What do you mean? There are scarier things than death. Now, second favor. Yeah, I'm kind of curious what that second favor was, but also... Hmm. Okay. And right here is the exact moment I realized I wasn't recording last time. See, so yeah, it says new, new information... Well, said new information acquired before. I'm wondering now. I think that was just a hint of what we needed to do to get this day done. And I'm kind of disappointed that we didn't get any of the... Vera seals through. Um, just because that was kind of the big thing of last episode. And good news, Bowden didn't kill us. You know, between episodes. I can't help but notice the purple. Carpincher. Every time you return to the last dawn, Vodin gets one you step say that, closer though. to finding this place. Repeating the same choices. It is a waste of precious time. Oh, yeah? Well. Is. Uh, I mean, actually, yeah, most of these do seem like a bit of a waste of time. Is this a waste of time? Yes. The answer is yes. It is slightly a waste of time. But, yeah, no more... I guess it's as purple as it was before. And with Vodin having looked at us last episode, from your perspective anyway, I think it's time we faced off with, well... Actually, I don't know if we're going to face off with Vodin, but I know this is where we go to move forward. Could do some backtracking, but, I mean, I'm in the mood for progress, you understand. So, next episode, yeah, we're going to go through Radica's timeline and see what we find. Who knows? But for now, thank you for your time. Note the like, comment, and subscribe buttons below. Use them responsibly, and I shall see you all soon. Bye-bye.